the season for love with Valentine's Day right around the corner. But of course, online scammers are targeting singles, taking the fun out of dating. The Better Business Bureau is warning people who use online dating apps or social media to find a match to be careful out there. Christian Garzone is in the studio with this story. Christian. Well, John Katrina, Melanie McGovern with the Better Business Bureau said there are a lot of imposters out there, people pretending to be someone else. Imposters do things like use fake photos to dupe someone into a relationship, and many times the end game is to get their hands on other people's money or to receive gifts. The scam, she said, can take a long time to form a deep connection. The imposter will build up an emotional bond with a the victim, then rip them off in all kinds of ways. McGovern says it's so important to invest investigate any date matches as thoroughly as, as thoroughly as you can before you give out any personal information. These are very common types of scams and they are very underreported because many times victims are embar embarrassed or ashamed. McGovern though is asking all those who fall for these scams to report it to the BBB. The more information that's collected, the more it can help. This scam can take months for the scammer to gain the person's trust, for the person to fall in love with them, and then they start asking for money. They have an emergency, they need a car repair, they're overseas, they need to get back to the States. And then what we've seen in the past is people will send that money, and then the scammer disappears. You're emotionally attached to this person at the other end of a keyboard that you really don't know. Not just these dating sites, it's also regular social media sites as well, like Facebook and the others. John Katrina, right back to you. Christian, thank you. McGovern it says a good documentary to watch is called The Tinder Swindler. It's a story that outlines this exact scenario. And be wary of people who ask for gift cards, banking information, or large loans.